Good evening. My name is Graham Goulian. I'm with the Churches of St. Paul's on the Hill and Trinity in Ossining, New York. Tonight we're going to be saying the Order of Compline, found on page 127 in the Book of Common Prayer. Just going to take a few moments to center ourselves and get ready for prayer. Let us begin on page 127. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own thought, in thought, in word, and deed, and in what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, forgive us all our offenses, and grant that we may serve you in newness of life, to the glory of your name. Amen. May the Almighty God grant us forgiveness of all our sins, and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. And now on page 131. Let us say together the words of Matthew 11, verses 28 through 30. Come to me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon, upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and lowly in heart, and you will find rest for your souls, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. From Hebrews chapter 13. May the God of peace, who brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus, the great shepherd of the sheep, by the blood of the eternal covenant, equip you with everything good, that you may do his will, working in you that which is pleasing in his sight, through Jesus Christ, in whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Be sober, be watchful. Your adversary, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. Resist him, firm in your faith. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Into you, Lord, O oh, into your hands, O oh Lord, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O oh Lord, O oh God of truth. Keep us, O oh Lord, as the apple of your eye, hide us under the shadows of your wing. Lord have mercy, Christ have mercy, Lord have mercy. And now let us say together the Lord's Prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Lord, hear our cry. Lord, hear our prayer and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Tonight, we pray for all of those in need. 
and the prayer list from Trinity and St. Paul's on the Hill. We pray for Michael, German, Chris, Nora, Charles and Curtis, Sue, and Jean and her family, Charmaine, for Jim and Marty and Janet and Rachel and Tess, Rebecca, Carla and Steve, for Rick and Dawn, St. Andrews of the Valley, Patricia, Kathy, Sandra, Jackie, Donald, Bill, Dorothy, Jada, Joe, and the Hernandez family. We pray for our essential workers. We pray for Holly and Ray, Alfreda, Jan, Alexis, Todd, Peter and Dina, Steve and Graham, Tanko, Pablo, Marco and Anthony. We pray for all the essential workers providing care here at Kings County Hospital in Brooklyn and for all those providing care everywhere for those who are sick and in need. We pray for those who have died, especially Wayne Mayenberg, Raphael Hernandez Jr., Dan Waring, and Michelle Graham. And the, we pray for others. Pray for those who have died this week in India from the COVID-19 virus and their families and all who are sick from COVID-19. Offer up your prayers for anyone in need tonight. Be our light in the darkness, O Lord, and in your great mercy, defend us from all perils and dangers of this night. For the love of your only Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chancelessness of this life may rest in your eternal changelessness. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Look down, O Lord, from your heavenly throne and illumine this night with your celestial brightness that by night as by day your people may glorify your holy name through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, and drive far from it all snares of the enemy let your holy angels dwell with us to preserve us in peace. And let your blessing be upon us always. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. We give you thanks, O God, for revealing your Son, Jesus Christ, to us by the light of his resurrection. Grant that as we sing your glory at the close of this day, our joy may abound in the morning as we celebrate the Paschal Mystery through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, you now have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest, with, rest in peace. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us. Amen. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Have a blessed evening. Amen.